Hello and welcome. This is mode cup number four. Finally, we are going to the fourth mode that is Clam Blitz. So, welcome. I am Pat here with Calliope. Calliope, how are you? I am doing wonderfully. I am excited for some Clam Blitz. This is probably my personal favorite mode out of all of them. Uh, aside from Table Turf, of course. But of the ranked <laughs> modes, Clam Blitz is absolutely my favorite. Yeah, if you are new to mode cap, this is a random maps. So our players will go and select, uh, ask for the game to give them a map. The mode is of course Clam Blitz and it will be for the whole tournament. We are in double elimination and we will start with Dreamers Shakers against ZRX Koji. Yeah, we got a we got a lot of hype for the Grimace Shakers already, just based off of the name. <laughs> yeah, I to. can't blame anyone. Oh, yeah, yes. <laughs> you have to admire that. But ZRX Koji, like we've seen them a bunch into uh, double productions tournaments before, and uh, I expect them like they have a bunch of tournament experience and don't count them out too. And especially mm. like it's Clam Blitz random map. Anything can happen. Right. Anything. Drama. But, yeah, unfortunately the one thing about it being random maps is that we can't talk about the maps ahead of time. We will have yes. to wait and see. We will know in a minute or two, like, as soon as the lobby is done and uh, the map is selected, we will tell you. But uh, not until then, like, we... oh, I see predictions are open, don't forget to gamble all your battle points. Mm -hmm. That's that's why you're watching, that's why everybody's watching at all. Right. Comment in chat, it's so you can gamble. <laughs> and yeah, like, I mean, I'm pretty interested, like watching i'm not used to doing like a uh, clams only tournament and this is a mode that is often overlooked especially like i'm a low level player um, amongst low level players mm -hmm. the mode is quite often like oh yeah it's chaos and there's nothing we can do if you come in this tournament you you have no choice but to tame that chaos and i can't wait to see what teams do just to, to make sure they win the games and advance in that environment. Indeed. Uh, Plan Blitz, uh, the main thing I would have to say is just that uh, the game doesn't really explain itself very oh, yeah. well when it comes to Clan Blitz. So that would be the majority of the intimidation. But like when you actually get down to you know how you play Clan Blitz um, and you know how you really succeed at the mode, it's very it, you know it's still Splatoon. Yeah, so Splatoon. You wanna you wanna control the majority of the territory up to the clan blast basket, and then potentially even push a little bit further. But I think we. Oh no, this is not match point. Don't bless. Yeah, I was this going to say you. it was about to fool me. Yeah. <laughs> this is <laughs> match point. We are still waiting for game one to start, so I don't think it's match point, and we are going to. Mahi, Mahi, Resort. Oh, fun! <laughs> what a way to start! And uh, right. no backline on the team. <laughs> oh, good. Uh, like that's the map where I'd expect to I see at least a splatling. I suppose that the the crab is going to be the backline, uh, yeah. but. We see, uh... Oh, terribly, terribly sorry. Grimace Shakers is the orange team, yes? Uh, yes, Grimace Shaker is... Grimace Shakers... Yellow, yellow. Oh, wow. Well. Uh, they, they get the opening push, and it's not over with two down on the side of ZRX Koji. And the Kraken tearing, like, a, a raining to absolute terror onto uh, ZRX Koji. That's going to be a very good first push by the Grimace Indeed. Shaker, getting to 51. And, uh, Not quite enough to lower the water, though. Yeah. So we will be still playing on this constricted map. 
We are staying there, but we are not far from it. And now it's uh, Zedarak's coach's turn to push forward and push forward. Mm -hmm. They are, but right now it's two versus two. And Pakuno is going to allow Koji to uh, bring uh, bring everybody in as fast as possible, especially with the big brother. And that's a lot of clans coming in. It's almost the lead. Oh, that's going to be there the we lead go. for Zedarak Koji. What is going down? And finally, we have a full map to play with. But Zedarex, they, they're not done yet. Okay, they're, they're kind of done. <laughs> they're, well, they didn't want to be done, but Grimace Shakers had yeah. something to say about it. And Grimace Shakers, they're already on the attack, and they have three specials ready to launch. And uh, they, they have the clans, they are going in. Crab Tank is activated. Every special is going off for Grimace Checkers. And here we have the Super Clan under the basket. Three players down, ZRX Koji. Yeah. Unfortunately, unable to defend the basket, and that will be lead going back to Grimace Shakers. Um, but not too much of a not too much of a swing. Uh, ZRX yep. is going to Oh no, you've got me saying it now. ZRX <laughs> is going to uh, Fortunately, keep this power claim way back and then break the enemy basket again. Yep. Yeah, Passing up clams to somebody who can't quite make it up there oh. yet. Oh, oh but, but a he... power clam in. Power clams in, and with just the zap left standing, Zerax Koji is going to have to leave mid to Grimace Shakers. And uh, I mean, it's been pretty back and forth so far. And both of these teams are showing us like they are pretty much even matched. So... Yeah, and that is, that is something that will happen with the uh, even matched uh, teams on Clan Blitz. Oh, of course. Yep. That's. But an even matched team on Clan Blitz can't really do too much against Kraken Cheese. Yeah, Kraken getting in, getting the drums. I mean, yeah. as long as your team is able to collect clans fast enough and you get the Kraken. Indeed. Oh, yeah. It. it... You it's, definitely uh, need to be able to support it, but it, it they were able to support it in that moment. They had everything they needed. Mm -hmm. So that will be Grimace Shakers taking it uh, very quickly. Yeah, I mean, very quickly, the both or teams very, uh, scoring. Summarily. Yeah, yeah, both teams scoring on each other, showing us like what they're made of. And if ZRX Koji gets a, a bit better of a push, they get the KO like earlier they were one super clam away from the ko and that super clam was live it was just like they managed to Rivers checkers managed to secure their basket area before that clam, super clam could get there but like zedarx could you were just a few seconds away from the ko themselves and now we are going to mince with better words of we course yes we, we and, do not get to have any space yeah but we if both teams are gonna keep not having a backline, and if they didn't mm -hmm. have a backline on, on Mahi, they're not gonna have a backline on Minsmith, right? Likely not, likely not. So, we will see. One interesting thing about Minsmith is that there's gratings to get to the basket. Rack and cheese mm -hmm. isn't that uh, easy here. Like, it's not free to, to get a Kraken there. So yeah. that's going to be very good for, for ZRX Koji. And this overall, is, yeah? This is the stage where you want to do brush cheese. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That, that could be it. And especially this is a stage where getting just one push with just one super clan could give you a victory, which would be the opposite of Mahi on that regard. And yes, I can see chat right now. No, we don't ban maps. If you want to win mode cup, you have to be good at everything this game has to offer. And let's see. And we see a uh, wiper deco on the side of Grimace Shakers. And th these missiles and these uh, beacons we will be very, very useful for them. Indeed. They're, I mean, Beacon and Missiles is a generally very good kit. It's just uh, the only downside is the Wiper is a fairly weak main weapon. 
at least just as far as kill power is concerned. It's got plenty of paint. You know, I gotta say that it's got weak kill power so it can go and go on a rampage and get some kills. <laughs> yeah, and right now, speaking of kills, both teams are just like trading with each other back and forth. Nobody really getting the advantage. It looks like ZRX Koji has uh, some control of me. Dimas Chick is making the soup to that hole. And uh, ready to push that forward. The crap tank is mm. going to be instantly destroyed yeah. by this Tamper. And that Tamper, by the way, is the longest range in the game right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a interesting one to have as your backline indeed, but it's... Oh. Ooh, the crab it, tank is in position, very aggressive position, and Primus Shakers are in a very good spot to uh, get forward. There's a super jump by the Wiper, the Wiper is going to score, and Primus Shakers are going to open the score. Much slower than on Mahi, but pretty good, honestly, like pretty fast mm -hmm. as an opening. And there are three versus two, they don't have that many clams though, and the basket is going to close now. Zelarix Kochi using the bubble and the cooler to get back that control. Wait, <laughs> what are you doing oh, here? <laughs> <laughs> what? And the, okay, Grimus Shakers are already back in, and there's uh, yeah. seven clams on the slusher, so just give them one clam, and that's going to be another opening. Wait. Ooh, not quite able to hit it. Oh, very, very like jumping in the corner, not really paying off for the no. Grimus Shakers. And right now, ZRX Kochi managing to salvage that situation that was so, so dire for them. Yeah, very, very fortunately, they did get the tactical they out, and so while they did go down, they came right back, and they got another tactical down again already. So they are going to continue putting on the pressure. As they will need to. Uh, we've got seven. Yeah, we've got seven clams here in the deck. The deco. So they don't need too zero much. Zero clams for Koji. Zerex yeah. Koji have zero clams. They, they they are keeping themselves alive. They are putting up a fight, but they are not making any points, and they're in no position to to do. To score any points right now, it's free down for Grimus Shakers, but ZRX Kochi, they don't have position, they don't have the clamps, and now they're picking up clamps. And they're, they're looking to make it, maybe make a ball, but there's two minutes left, and ZRX Kochi has yet to, to mount any attack. Ooh, getting in deep just to get those clamps. And Ilias putting the bubbler there. ZRX Kochi, now they have like a lot of but both times are going off. It's just the zap and Purple the stamp. Strike. Yeah, clearing things away there. And, and that means Grimus Shakers, like, by hitting that zap, they get rid of all the clans that Zed are exposed to holding. They are, again, in full control of the objective, despite Zed are exposed to contesting the map very, very well. Yeah, it's, uh... It goes to show it's it's not just painting in this mode. Mm -hmm. The painting helps and splatting helps too. Grimus Shakers, they are again in a position to push to attack. It's three down for ZRX Kochi. It's just the, the splatter shot with a Z-Tap. is not going to do much. And Grimus Shakers, they are extending that lead. They don't even need to with one minute left. They want more points. And with 25... There will be three just... down, though. Yeah. Now, that would be a staggered wipe. That's a staggered wipe, but look! With the, with the deco, with the beacon, that's not a problem from Grimus Shakers. Grimus Shakers, they're already back in the game! They don't care, they get delayed wipe. They're here! And uh, they have all the points, and they are still an absolute threat everywhere on the map. Mm -hmm. I'm just continually stealing all the clams before uh, ZRX can get them. Yeah, the yes, one. The... Yes, has the not their pity. Stay alive. Yeah, that's that's a pity. Yeah, so they need to move forward now, and it's three versus two. Koji, you need to move now because they will respawn very fast, and they have the beacons. The, the, the water is already ready to absolutely punish Ooh. everything. So it's the slusher, and that's yeah, the that's a wipeout. 
That's going to be gauge. It did hit a power clam through, but... Yeah. It's gonna be totally late, and like, they pay so much for it. It's just like Grimace Shakers being slightly faster, and profiting from this map better, like... Mm -hmm. And that will be Grimace Shakers taking it, 75 to 20. Yeah, ZRX Koji not done with this tournament though. This is double elimination. So not the end for them, but uh, Grimace Shakers advances in winner's bracket. Congratulations to them and we will show you the next game right after this very short break. Don't go anywhere. <laughs>